guys. Yeah, this is the end of the third week in February. Um, in the winter months here in the Baja, we like to target Sierra mackerel. Um, I really, I love targeting them. They're an awesome little fish, you know, not very big. My personal best uh, was a fish a little over four kilos, which was pretty awesome. But yeah, super fun to catch, very good eating, very good eating fish. And you can prepare them in a lot of different ways, super tasty. And I thought I'd put a little video here together on my top tips to catch Sierra mackerel, especially when it's a little bit tough. Um, tip number five, get there early. You know, I think you, you want to you wanna fish, get there early. I like to start fishing in the dark just before first light. And I find that most of the time it is a very short bite window. You know, you've got 30 minutes up to an hour where it's really good and then they go off the bite. So you want to get there early. Um, tip number four, the lures. Everybody's got their own favorite lures, you know, with Sierra mackerel, basically any metal jig, any shiny metal jig, chrome is going to work well. Um, I'm particular, particularly fond of this sort of shape, the sardine shape. Um, this is one of my favorites. Um, two ounces, I like two ounces with my setup, two ounces and three ounces. You know, I, I like this little shape. The edging is, is for me, I think gives the lure a little bit more movement. And yeah, these are you know some of my favorites. Um, but yeah, everybody's got their own got their own secret lures, but um, <clears throat> those work pretty well for me. Um, tip number three would be long casts. You know, I think you, you wanna you want to try and you know, sometimes I find you know you get those hits at the end of a long cast. So you know you want to set up that you can get your lure out there as far as you can. Um, and definitely helps and yeah tip number two speed you know the speed your retrieve rate you know so a reel that that has a high speed retrieve rate I, you know, i'm fishing with this setup i'm fishing with the new saragossa shimano saragossa the 14,000. and yeah, i've been very happy with it it's pretty quick i think it has a, a retrieve rate of something like 53 inches per crank which is pretty fast and I think that definitely helps, you know, for a lot of species and particularly Sierra, you know. Um, and then, yeah, my, my tip number one would be action. Uh, the retreat, your action, the movement on the lure. So, you know, the way you, you put, um, the way you use your rod, you retrieve. I like to jig the lure up from the bottom quite aggressively. And often I, I drop it down again and jig it up. And I find that erratic movement really triggers strikes. Um, you know, obviously, you know, when the conditions are good and, and there's a lot of fish around and there's a lot of bait, you know, you can throw your lure out and you're pretty much guaranteed you're going to get a hit. You know, you can retrieve it straight in and you're going to get something, you know. But, you know, on the days where it's a little bit more difficult, I often find when you put that extra action on the lure, you know, you get those strikes, you know. At the same time, I, I find that I lose a lot more lures like that, you know, because of the way I think the lure is darting up. You know, it, I get a lot, a lot more cutoffs, um, but definitely a lot more strikes. Um, so yeah, for me, those are my, my, my personal five top tips. Great fish to go after here in the Baja in the winter. And yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you want to see any more um, Sierra action, please check out my other video. It was a really good morning. I had not so long ago. And, and yeah, we'll see you guys soon.